Nico, what's this I hear about you running with Patrick McQuarrie? He's got work, and he's a good guy. You're not planning on taking him down, are you? Lay off him, for me. I'm not planning on taking him down. He's my damn brother, you idiot. Packy McCreary, Francis McCreary. It's all starting to make sense. I knew Irish families were big, but I didn't expect to run into brothers in the place the size of Liberty City. Yeah, just thank the Lord you ran into Packy and not my other brothers. Packy's just a hood, but Gerald is into some serious shit. And Derek, he's the worst. If that asshole ever comes back from Ireland, I can't be held responsible for what I do. My brothers ain't no good, Nico. Trust me on that. You know what? Me and Packy get along. Maybe if doing what you do is good, then I want to be no good instead. I should meet the other McCreary's. Be careful what you wish for. Nico, I'm getting worried. Roman didn't get back at all last night. He likes to party. He stays out late the whole time. You know what he's like. Not on my watch, he don't. Something ain't right. Listen, I know what you must be thinking, but don't bother. I'm sorry, but I don't see how you know what I must be thinking. You've killed people. <sighs> you should be dead yourself. Or inside. You're just lucky it was me and not someone else who got their hooks into you. I'm sorry that I lied to you. <sighs> and... And weirdly, in some ways, you're a nice guy. Better than the creeps I normally date. But you're damaged goods. No doubt. Let's go. Boys, flag In ball. here. Salute? Eat my ass, buddy. I'm up for the promotion, and you're not. What the hell are we doing here? We're going to meet someone. Sounds fun. You know, you and your cousin, you should get out. What you're looking for, you won't find. Feds are all over it. Crime is done. You've watched too many movies. Whatever you say, Michelle, or whatever your name is. It's Karen. My name is Karen. Interesting. And you whore for the government. I kind of like the honesty in that. I have a clear conscience. How very lucky for you. <sighs> in here, Office 396. Hi there. Here he is. I can see that. Thanks, Karen. Hey, cheer up. You did good. You'll get a Sammy. If you care about that sort of thing. Thank you. So, Mr. Bellic, quite a file, quite a story. Who are you? The FIB? The FIB? Do I look homosexual? Do you think I care about the size of your Johnson? Now, you can't always tell who the good guys are. I'm not a good guy, but I'm fighting with them. And guess what? So are you. Hooray. That's the spirit. Nothing like a bit of sarcasm when someone's got you by the balls. Now, I need you to find something out for me. Find out everything you can about a man called Oleg Minkoff. He lives on Iroquois, back in Hove Beach. And if I say no? I hand your file over to those cretins in the FIB, and organized crime has dealt another serious blow. Go to his house. Any problems, call this number. Hmm. What's your name? Not relevant. Call me. Very soon. Go. And hey. Welcome to America. Pascala Stara Dejava. Bushka.
Mr. Minkov? Anybody here? What have you got for me? Not much. He keeps a clean house, he's got a computer. Check his emails. Call back with any information that would indicate his current whereabouts. There's an email that says he's meeting someone at Tulsa Street in Hove Beach. Perfect. I'll send someone to pick up the hard drive. You go to Tulsa Street. Eliminate Minkoff. Whoa. Killing is very different from gathering information. You are acting in the interest of your new countrymen and keeping yourself out of prison. For once, this is a murder you don't have to feel confused about. Dispose of Minkoff. Then call me. Live so can you space. take me to Mohawk Avenue, yes? Thanks. Василий, спасибо, что пришел. Олег, ты испугал меня. Я даже подумал, что это человек. Все, он меня дожидался. Пока, братан. Minkoff is dead. The country is safe. Not by a long shot, smartass. Nothing is safe. No one is safe. Maybe something has been averted. Maybe delayed. I'll be in touch. Goodbye. <laughs> 